Now, as South Korea retaliates against Tokyo by officially dropping Japan from its whitelist of countries with that fast-track trade status, a growing number of foreign media outlets are expressing their own concerns. They warn the situation has all the hallmarks of becoming a protracted grind of attrition between the two neighbours. Kim Hyo-sun reports. Following South Korea's decision to drop Japan from its fast track trade whitelist, many international media outlets forecast the trade rope between the Asian neighbors is unlikely to be resolved anytime soon. The New York Times published an article Monday which explained that Seoul's move was anticipated when Japan removed South Korea from its own whitelist. The article titled South Korea Retaliates Against Japan in Trade and Diplomatic Rift also stated the tit for tat measure shows the two countries will not back down despite President Trump's calls for improved relations. Trump said last Friday that the two nations should sit down and get along with each other. CNN reported Monday that Seoul has heightened the crisis that is already disrupting the global supply chain for large tech companies. U.S.-based business news website Business Insider also said Monday that the decades-long tensions between the two Asian countries are now threatening to boil over. It explained the tensions bubbled to the surface last year when the South Korean Supreme Court ordered certain Japanese companies to compensate South Korean wartime forced laborers. Reuters also reported on Seoul's move, describing it as a measure that deepens the diplomatic and trade road between the two countries. Kim Hyo-san, Arirang News.